So you want to use three screens in Microsoft Flight Simulator? Don't worry, we got you covered. Let's start by looking in our desktop at the screen setup. Right click and go to display settings. We get to see three displays, make sure they are arranged correctly from left to right. Then check which one is your main screen. Mine for example is the center one marked as number one. So that's the first step. Now let's go get the tool that we're going to use called Simple Runtime Window Editor. Once you go into GitHub, you will see a page like this. Make sure you scroll down past the description to profiles. Now over there you will see the releases, click on that. It got us to the download page where we pick a version of the program. Let's choose the first one. We save it and then we open the archive and extract it to our desktop for example. Once that is done, you just open the exe file and you're gonna find this program which basically selects a process that is on and changes the window size. Now the next step, if you find yourself in the simulator, press the Windows key and then right click on the taskbar and select taskbar settings. Over here we will click on auto hide the taskbar in desktop mode. That will help us once we resize the sim for three screens. Next we want to switch the simulator in window mode, which is done from the option general tab by selecting display mode and switching to windowed mode. or by simply pressing the right ALT key followed by the ENTER key. Now that we have our simulator in window mode, let's open our program. Now my program already picked the simulator, but let me show you how to select the process. On the left side, you click on SELECT RUNNING APPLICATION and select Microsoft Flight Simulator. Now that we have the sim selected, we see the current displayed resolution in window mode. Now I have a profile for three Full HD screens that will give us the right size for our resolution of 5760 by 1080. You can enter these numbers manually and then save your profile. Now let me show you what happened. The simulator is spanned over your three screens. It may be a bit on your right and you can move it in two ways. One is by dragging the window in place, which won't be that precise, but just to make sure you understand, I do it now. Or second is to press the H center key in the application. But first, let's recap all together how you can resize and center so we don't get lost in the process. So making sure we are in window mode, we open the program, we select the process, and over here, we enter the right numbers for the three screen resolution. After that, we press H center or left or right, depending on where the windows are, and we can even remove the borders. And that's it. You have the simulator span on three screens. Now remember that this process will impact your performance. With my current setup, I lost around nine FPS. But that also depends on where you are in the simulator. I want to thank you for watching. This tutorial was something I wanted to share for some time now. If you need more support, please join our Discord. Link is in the video description. And also, you can join us live on Twitch. Fly safe and I'll see you next time.